richest I want to show you guys something. My brain got home. So guys, <laughs> guys, hey you guys. I woke up since 5 a.m. Yeah, even today I'm not working, but yet I woke up since like 5 a.m. I prepared Emmanuel. I did some things for hobby, prepare his lunch, and right now I just want to like clean the house, prepare breakfast for me. I have some bills that I need to go and pay. I need to pay house rent. I need to go to the bank. I also need to do what again? I need to go to the post office. Yeah, the weather is a bit cloudy today. And I got all these that just arrived, all these stuff. I need to like go and pay them, okay? Yeah, so that costs a lot of money, you know? <laughs> if I want to quickly arrange all these things, I, I watched this once also this early morning. Last night I was very, very tired. I didn't watch them. But this morning when I woke up trying to get him and ready for school, I watched everything. So right now what I want to do, I just reach also having my bath. I'm like, okay, let me just start a vlog here. Yeah? And um, my neck is paining me. I didn't sleep very well. Uh, this morning I'm not going to do makeup. I'm going to just wear my wig. Let me go get my wig and make breakfast quickly. I'll see you guys in my next clip. <laughs> Yeah. I so, not like to dance you. yeah, this is like a morning routine. So I just finished, like I said earlier, I finished doing some morning shots. I'm at school. Right now, making breakfast for me. Woke up since 5 a.m. I usually wake up at 5 a.m. Even if I don't go to work, okay? Because I'm so used to waking up at 5 a.m. That's just. Honestly, I just remove one thing from this egg. I don't really like seeing that thing in my head. So the next time I'm going to use, I'm using my brain for my for frying my egg. Acting like I don't know. So Sound it. Yeah, yeah. Just a quick breakfast. Quick breakfast. Like trying to like uh, toast my bread. I'll just add some little bit of this ground egg here. Ground egg here, seasoning, last Okay, I'll add a pinch of salt. I don't really like salt. Let's see. Uh, twice, twice a day, okay? Twice a day, I no longer eat three times eat any hour. I'm trying to reduce the way I eat. Um, I'm only weight loss journey in the sense that this period of this type of weight loss, I'm not going to check on whether I eat. I don't want to eat any hour, okay? I guess I'm a big Okay, let's 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 let's
Oh, yeah, get down on the face, my baby. I know you feel. My brain got burnt. What am I going to do? Throw it away. Mm. At this point in time, I'm going to scratch the brain. Yeah, it's okay. Mm. Can you guys see that? It is very very black like this now. But when I put it in the microwave, put my tea and just put it to boil there, it's gonna change the color. <laughs> I I like saw it yesterday when I used it yesterday. So see, take note now. As you're watching me, take note, it's black a bit. When I want to eat, I'll take you guys to the table so you guys will see how it changes color and tell me in the comment section what color you saw. I should do my face like this. So guys, can you guys see the cup? Let me know the color you've, you've seen now in the comment section, okay? So this is my breakfast room. I just want to have this breakfast. After which, I'm going to go out and go and pay all this bill. I have like 500 euro I was trying to pay. I think, and the other bills, the one in the post, I think I'll be spending like 700 euro today. That's a lot of money, man, I'm here. Give and take, give and take. Come on, join me, guys. Hmm. Join me. It's just very, very good breakfast, okay? I'm very healthy with the brown bread. There's something I want to talk about. Something All this news this has been going on, on on social media. I talked about it before. Cora and um, Justin, you know? I talked about it because I had to like, okay, let me just talk about this because I did the one of Lily and um, just James. So I think this issue, you know, when I initially saw it, um, when uh, Justin, uh, so social media sites were just going up and down. How the husband Justin said he's going to sue Cora for divorce, that he's no longer getting married to her, and a lot of people are posting different things. But yesterday I saw two posts, and I'm like, okay, let me just like talk about this divorce thing again because i think this thing uh justin is really really you know the first post he was he want to sue after he said he's not being treated well later he said uh, uh nazi stuff that is not being treated well and all that and you know if you see different different thing different, different topic like that about him and cora on the social media so we don't even know which one to believe but this one this post i got it direct from is this is is like i am feeling paperwork this week i will always be there for my children that is always going to be there for his children and which are the best this is this has absolutely nothing to do with postpartum depression that the divorce issue a lot of people are like it has got to do with postpartum so he is said he is telling us now that no this has nothing to do with postpartum and there is another lengthy lengthy post that he posted and this is why i am like okay i need to like talk about this again because initially i am of the opinion that is a prank is fake this that this is getting out of fake and out of prank in the sense that what i saw yesterday that justin posted made me want to do this again and i'm going to read it for you guys and i'll place it up here somewhere for you guys to see don't mind whatever you see here this is my um whatever i want to go and pay and this my stuff i'm eating with my <laughs> so let me read this for you guys to like anyone that knows me or watches me online knows that I am a dedicated family man to both Cora and my children. This is honestly the hardest decision of my life, but necessary. Oh my God. 
He said it's a hard decision for him to take, but it is very, very necessary that he takes this decision. I am, I am walking away from this marriage for my mental health and to be the best version of myself. I must see, I must like, I must set a healthy example for my children. He's walking away out of the marriage. He wants to have his mental health. He wants to be okay. He wants to set a healthy example for his children. This has nothing to do with postpartum depression. I have been betrayed. This post was posted yesterday, okay? So it is recent, very, very recent. Okay, it's not, it now goes further to say that this has nothing to do with postpartum depression. I have been betrayed once again, and she is unbothered, which pretty much summarizes our marriage. Okay, uh, he has been, uh, how did he say it? He has been betrayed once again. That's why a lot of people say that uh, they said different stuff, but he didn't say the reason he was betrayed, but he's betrayed. Every normal woman will know what what we mean by betrayal, okay? That that summarizes their marriage. That Cora is betraying them, and Cora is not treating him well. And my apology to all the young men and women that believe we had a perfect marriage. So what they have been showing on social media, which means it's not really, really that perfect. They are just showing what they feel is good because you know me. Like I always say. I will not come outside. Need to now come and when me and my husband quarrel and bring the quarrel for you guys to come and see me. I'm not that type of social media freak, okay? But with what he said here, it means that even it means that they are showing us what they want us to see. That when they quarrel, they are not showing us and all that stuff. They are showing us different things that make us think that their marriage is perfect, but it's not perfect. Anyway, no marriage is perfect. Every marriage has ups and downs. It's how you try to like work on it that matters a lot. Marriage is based on. Mutual love, respect, humility, accountability, empathy, apologies, and most of all, effective communication to understand the other person's perspective. I've always said this is based on communication, um, accountability, empathy, trying to put yourself in the other person's shoe. In case you don't know what is empathy, putting yourself in the other person's shoe. Put yourself, enter into the situation and know how that person is feeling. That is the meaning of empathy. So that is what he's trying to tell us here, that um, Cora is not giving him all this. And since he has been coming out to say different things, Cora has never come out to say anything. Rather than you see Cora dancing, making her hair, uh, cooking, uh, trying to like not say anything, but I don't know why, but that is not why I'm here. Why I'm here is just to let you guys know the update, let you guys see that this is what Justin posted yesterday, and it's like it's like Cora is not apologizing to him, Cora is not treating him well. So, right now, he's walking away and he's doing this for his mental health. Our uh, mental health is very, very important, and yeah, so uh, I'll leave the post like I said for you guys to see. So that is what Justin posted, you know. I really don't know. I think this thing is like getting like out of hand because he said he's walking away. Uh, now he's no, he's quitting. He's no more happy with the marriage any longer because of the way Cora is treating him, not treating him very well, and she does not apologize. There's no communication. In fact, he also said something that I forgot to read. Let me read that. It's the last thing he said is lies and views shouldn't be the highlight of your relationship. What does that tell you? Let me know in the comment section. Put your opinion in the comment section. When Justin said that lies and views shouldn't be the highlight of your relationship, what does he mean by this? Let me know. Put it down in the comment section if you know and you know likes and views shouldn't be the shouldn't be shouldn't be the highlight of your relationship because Cora is the type of person that's always on social media in fact she does live stream like three four five times in a day and she has two kids and she's newly in fact she's a strong woman that's all i can say but uh for the man to say that you shouldn't make the views and the likes your highlight of your relationship what does he mean by that put your thoughts in the comment section let me finish my breakfast because my breakfast is getting cold. <laughs> From, I will see my next one. Give the video a thumbs up. Feel free to share to your friends, family, loved ones. I didn't even give my introduction as usual. My name is Rachel. 
I mean, Nigerian YouTuber based in Italy. I create content around lifestyle. If this is what you want to see, please subscribe to this channel. Press that red button, press it, put it to all. So that whenever I upload a new video, you'll be the first to be notified. Richest